How's it going everyone? My name is Darren and I'm with muzzleloaders.com and today I'm going to bring you a short review of the Investarm Hawken Carbine. So we showed up at the range this morning. It is a little foggy, so we're waiting for some of that fog to burn off. And I figured I'd bring you a quick review of this Investarm Hawken Carbine. Now this is not gonna be an extensive Hawken Carbine review. We didn't do any shooting or anything like that. This is just gonna be talking about some of the unique features because this muzzleloader uh, is pretty unique in the muzzleloader world right now. And so we're gonna just dive right into that stuff. So it distinguishes the Hawken Carbine from other Investarm or even just other Hawken models in general is the shorter barrel. So this has a 24 inch barrel, whereas most other Hawken models have around a 28 or sometimes even longer. That 24 inch barrel makes this muzzleloader lighter and more compact than your typical Hawken, uh, making it perfect for a lot of hunting applications. This muzzleloader also has a .350 dovetailed uh, front and rear sight, as well as a spring-loaded single trigger. Now, there's kind of two schools of thought on the single trigger versus double set. Um, I personally really like the single trigger for hunting application just because it's a little bit simpler. And, uh, but for like, I can see where if you're doing bench rest or doing some kind of precision, having that double set trigger is, is kind of important. The model I have here today is the 50 caliber flintlock version, but it is available in 45, 50 and 54 caliber, as well as percussion models. And for all of you South paws out there, uh, it is available in a left-handed configuration. And one of the cool things that about Investarm is they actually are one of the few manufacturers that make a left-handed uh, build-it-yourself kit. And so if you're left-handed and you're looking to do a kit, uh, an Investarm Hawk and Carbine or maybe the Gimmer or Bridger, those are going to be excellent options for you. Now let's turn our attention to the barrel. And uh, this 24-inch barrel has a 1 in 48 twist rate. And so that is one of the most versatile twist rates out there. You can shoot it effectively with round balls or with conicals, and you're going to have pretty good accuracy either way. And last but not least, the overall fit and finish of this muzzleloader is incredible. I think Investarm has done an excellent job uh, with the Gimmer and the Bridger, and then now most recently with the Hawk and Carbine with their fit and finish, uh, as well as the Hawk and Carbine here has a lot of uh, brass uh, furniture on it, which makes it look really nice. I'm very excited about this addition from Investarm. I think the shorter 24 inch barrel that is a little bit more uncommon uh, is actually very beneficial in a lot of situations, especially for hunting. And so uh, if you're looking to pick up a new side lock, I definitely recommend taking a look at the Investarm Hawk and Carbine. Well, that's about all I had for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you have any questions on this muzzleloader, drop them in the comments below and uh, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one.